Um, what we're showing here is mixed reality today. Mixed reality is kind of the closest uh, people can get to understanding what VR feels like uh, by being able to actually see the player in the game. So um, without giving you too technical of an explanation, we're basically recording three different items. We're recording the foreground of the scene, the player, and then the background, which is the green screen. And we're layering all of those together and then choosing independently that we want the game and then we want the player. And so that allows you to see the player actually in the environment. So you were in there a minute ago, and so behind when we were watching you from the screen, we actually saw you from the back playing in the game, your real body, moving around in the VR world. And so it really gives people a really good idea about how VR is experienced. Right. The most unique thing about Vive is what we call room scale VR. So being able to get up and walk around the room and you know, because you were playing Space Pirate Trainer, you were dodging bullets physically with your body moving left and right. So we built in a system we call the Chaperone. The Chaperone works just like a chaperone on a field trip. It watches over you and keeps you protected. So as you started to approach any perimeter, whether it was the wall or the computer or somebody else in the room, uh, a virtual grid will appear that we, we call the Chaperone. And that, that chaperone will appear when you get close and disappear when you back away. So that's what prevents you from bumping at objects. Uh, mixed reality takes some additional takes some additional equipment. Um, so yeah, it, it's not something that I think every consumer is going to want to do. Uh, most consumers are going to want to put on the headset and go jump inside and play. Um, this is really good for uh, you know companies, uh, developers who actually want to show people what they're doing. There's a lot of different outlets right now. They're they're starting to do Facebook live streams of mixed reality so that people can really get a good idea about what it is. So, you know our marketing efforts right now are laser focused on getting vibe in the hands of as many people as possible. This is just another way to potentially get people uh, actually experiencing what VR is.